okay let us discuss this question now it says uh, find the value of x and y here you are given a figure in which a b and c d are two lines and uh, you can say t is transversal and then we need to show that a b is parallel to c d now you can see here that x is making a linear pair with this angle a let us label this o p so angle a o p and this x is making a linear pair so what can you say about this x yes x plus 60 will be equal to 180 degrees okay now observe these two here we can say that the transversal t and c d are two intersecting lines and uh, we see that y and 120 degrees they are making vertically opposite angles and we know that vertically opposite angles are equal so what will be the value of y that is 120 degrees so x will be 120 degrees y is also 120 degrees so we see that they are making a pair of alternate interior angles so they are equal so ab is parallel to cd so let us learn how to write this in examination so first thing is we are going to write down what is given so in this question it is given that angle aop is 60 degrees and we can label this point also let let it be g so angle c g and here also we can take up a point say for example capital t so angle c g t is 120 degrees this is given and uh, we have to find the values of x and y and also we have to show that a b is parallel to c d right so let us see how we are going to do this so we are going to write down its solution now we say that in the given figure we are considering so consider we are considering two lines now consider lines a b and c d and transversal we have named it that is pt right so in this we notice that 60 degrees plus x is equal to 180 degrees because it is making a linear pair so from here we get the value of x that is 180 minus 60 that is 120 degrees okay similarly if we see here y is equal to 120 degrees because they are making vertically opposite angles and we know that vertically opposite angles are always equal so therefore we have got the values of x is equal to y is equal to 120 degrees now it is making a pair of alternate interior angles so we write down which is making a pair of alternate interior angles and alternate interior angles are equal therefore AB is parallel to CD therefore AB is parallel to CD I hope it is clear to you